Hey everybody, how's it going? So, warm up today is two uh, separate warm ups. Uh, the first one is three rounds, 30 seconds for each movement, followed by a minute of rest. So, you're gonna start in a high plank. So, you're just gonna hold that high plank nice and tight. Okay, watch for this. Look out for that. Nice and tight. Shoulders are backing down. Get out of that lower back. Okay, here, point those elbows back and down your body, squeeze those heels together. And then we're on to a low plank. So again here, watching out for the same stuff. And then we're on to our Superman. So squeeze, 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 squeeze. Get your chest and thighs off the ground. And then flip over into a hollow hold or some rocks. All right? Rest one minute. Do that two more times for a total of three rounds. Once that's done, you have two rounds of five T-spine squats. Just put your hand on the floor, reach, reach, all right, stand up. Five of those, if you have a hard time with that, put your kettlebell in front of you, use that. You might find it helps a little bit, okay? So five of those, and then five single leg deadlifts, no kettlebell. When you come through, so stay square to the floor, when you come through, Let's keep our foot off the floor. A little balance practice. All right? So make the toes here real big. Spread them out. Okay? Five each side there. Then um, holding on to something. TV. You got five leg swings. Don't kick or break anything. Five leg swings per side. And then ten two-hand swings. There you go. Two rounds of that to finish off your warm-up. And then... We've got a Tabata workout, eight rounds for each section, 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest, followed by one minute of rest after the end of the eight rounds. So A block or A station, we just, we're just doing swings, okay? You can change it up. You can do two hand swings. You can do single hand swings maybe one round and single hand swing on the other side. You make it yours today, okay? So... Swings for eight rounds, 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. Once that's done, rest one minute. Then we're on to uh, odd or even, doesn't matter, uh, plank to press. So one round of plank to press. All right, so you're doing this for 20 seconds. And then resting your 10 seconds. And then you're on even for the next round. Bicycle crunches. So we're here, boom, get that knee to elbow, okay? So four rounds of those alternating. Then from there, after your minute of rest, we're going overhead lunges. So get the kettlebell overhead however you like. I like to keep the kettlebell over the same plant leg because this is gonna help me in my get up. You're going 20 seconds one side, resting for 10, and then you'll do 20 seconds on the other. All right, watch for this elbow bending as you get tired. Keep that guy locked out. If it becomes too much, just go overhead with no kettlebell, okay? So left and right, four rounds each side there. And then finally, figure eight with a press and kettlebell jumps. So one round of figure eights. Don't drop the kettlebell. All right, right here. So. Notice how I kind of hinge when I do this, and I don't squat down. All right, keeping that bell nice and close. From there, so 20 seconds of that, and then we have our kettlebell jumps. So our kettlebell's in between our feet. We're here, and we're just jumping, okay? Careful with that. Uh, body weights, jumping squats are just as good, okay? So there's your workout, enjoy.